The Go programming language, or Golang, is an open source programming language created by Google. My name is Shad Sluter, and I teach software development at Grand Canyon University. Subscribe to this channel if you want to follow what my students learn every day in class. We use a variety of languages to create web and mobile apps. Robert Griesmer, I, uh, Rob Pike, and Ken Thompson developed Golang in uh, 2007 to improve programming productivity. They mostly worked in multi-core computers, networked machines, and large code bases. Go is used for various tasks, including web development, cloud services, DevOps, data science, and much more. Go is known for its simplicity and strong support for concurrent programming. Some programmers would say that Go is a good competitor for C or C++ since it compiles directly to machine executable code. This is a valuable feature of Go since it allows the compiled programs to run with high performance and without the need for an interpreter or a virtual machine. Golang is known for its um, clean syntax, making it easy to read and write code and compiles quickly. The language has built-in support for concurrent programming, which is useful with parallel processing, asynchronous functions, and load-balanced applications. It comes with a rich standard library useful for building web servers. Automatic memory management with garbage collection can prevent certain kinds of memory errors. Go can compile for different platforms with minimal hassle. Go can be a wise choice for programmers. Its simplicity and efficiency make it an excellent language for quickly developing scalable, high-performance applications. Let's delve into some basic Go code. Here's how you'd write a simple program to print Hello World. In this snippet, package main signifies a standalone executable program. Import FMT brings in the format package for input output. The print line function is used to print the text to the screen. Now let's look at a simple function to add two numbers. This code defines a function add, which takes two integers as arguments and returns their sum. In the main function, we call add with two numbers and print the result to the screen. With Go's growing ecosystem and strong standard library, you'll find it a powerful tool for many of your programming jobs. If you would like to see how C-sharp compares to Go, then follow this video. Please like and subscribe to tell Google that this video is valuable. They will likely recommend it to other programmers.